showing you through. Today I'm going to be reviewing something I bought last week in a magazine. Uh, I quite often buy magazines when I get free gifts. And this is the Saint Coupe Shower Tan. UK's first in shower tan, quite in innovative. Um, so we'll see how that works. It's a gradual tan, so it should be quite mild. And so I'm going to hop in the shower. And, and try it out for you and see what I think. And they've given me a generous size here of 50 ml, so let's take it out. This is the product. Such a day. 50 ml. I'm interested to try this. So here we go. Gradual in shower tan. What did I think of it? Well, first of all, I'm going to say a few of the do's and don'ts that they've got on the packaging because I don't always read the back, and I think a lot of people don't, do they? So I know we need to look at the things, the instructions on the back, just for safety. So first of all, it says to do a patch test. Now you should do this 24 hours in advance of using it. So find a area of skin you want to put it on. Um, put the cream on as you would when you're using it in the shower. So leave it for three minutes and then wash it off with warm water. Then leave overnight, 24 hours, then check it. If there's no irritation or redness, then you're probably good to go. Also don't use this if um, your skin's broken, uh, bruised, irritated or rash or anything like that cut, not to use it then. Uh, also it says don't get on your lips for some reason, maybe it makes them a funny colour, and obviously don't get in your eyes, and I think that's all the precautions there. So okay, the cream is a kind of a very light golden colour, so it's not white, 
It's kind of a light cream colour. And it smells, mm, just a tiny bit funky. Just the smell of suntan lotion or suntan product. It's got like a, I don't know, like a yeast smell or something. It's not unpleasant, but it's not a perfume smell. It's very easy to use. Very easy to use. It's very enjoyable to use. I'm surprised I liked it. I'm going to put it down now. Um, you just wash your body like you would normally with a, a sponge or a cloth or whatever you use and with your shower gel and clean yourself. Then rinse it off, stand back from the shower and then apply the lotion covering wherever you want to tan. Um, you don't have to be too fussy because this is non-streak, doesn't streak. And uh, because it, you're doing it in the shower, it doesn't have to be a perfect application. And I think probably the more you use, the more colour will develop. And it's um, it works concurrently, so if you were to use it one night in the shower, you'd get a nice golden colour the next day. And if you use it the following day in the shower, the colour will deepen. So the more you use it, the deeper the colour will go. It's a sun maintainer and it's also a gradual tanner. So it's quite a handy item, particularly useful in the winter when we're quite pale and we just want to keep a bit of colour about us. Um, very convenient to use. What else? It's one colour, they only have it in one colour at the moment. Uh, maybe they'll bring it down different colours, I don't know, I don't know if it's necessary. And also they say that the product may turn a different colour in the tube over time, but not to worry about it, it's still good to go, it's still good to use. This is the 50ml size I got free in a magazine. The full size, it's probably 100ml isn't it, or 150 has little um, diagrams on the back of what you do, how you use it. And it contains sweet almond oil, amongst other things. Um, it's also a very slippery substance, so if you get it in your shower, in the bath, or on the floor, be very careful because it's extremely slippery, and um, make sure you don't break your neck. It gave um, a good colour. I mean, I've got quite a good tan, I suppose, for me. So, um, and I haven't been out for two days in, in the sun, because there's been no sun, it's been really filthy over here and um, yeah I think it's hard for me to tell but it seems to have given a golden glow. It is more golden than it was so yes I mean I've used it twice so probably has. It seems like a nice product. So just do your patch test, very important. It's fun applying it um, when you've finished applying it in the shower, wash your hands because it will stay in your hands. And when you take it off after the three minutes, use warm water, not hot. And pat dry with a towel, don't rub. Pat gently dry, give it a few minutes and then press it and you're ready to go. So I think I would say I like this product. I think it's a good product. It's new. It's different. <laughs> but... <laughs> Everything's going to change, isn't it? We're going to come up with new things all the time. So I like Centro Play as, as a brand. And I think it's an interesting product. I don't know if I would use it because I don't tend to self-tan much. I prefer like a makeup bronze or something. But um, it's an interesting product. I'm sure it's going to be very popular. So that's my mini review of it because I've only been using it two days. So um, enjoy if anybody's got it. Let me know how you get on. Leave some comments for me so I know how it's worked on you. Okay, thanks, Eugene. I think it's about, I think it's on offer at the moment actually, if you want to go to Boots, but I can't remember how much it is now, £10 or something. Mm -hmm.